I'm going to live somewhere else. What? What are you talking about? Pack my things. I'm going to live somewhere else. You can't. You're only a child. Well, I don't look you and I don't want to live here. No more. You silly, silly girl. You can't move. You're only a child. <laughs> yeah, well, I hate you. I hate you. You hear me? <laughs> oh, you keep on saying that. Well, I'll do it. I'll move. I'm moving out. And that is it. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> Foxina, what is this gem? What does it do? What's happened? The gem has all the power in the world. If you're willing to take the consequences. Well, and the consequences are you're in pain. Yes. Can you use it to revert token back? I don't know. I don't know. I wanted to get one back on token because she's stupid. She's annoying. <laughs> What's so funny, Glow? Whoa, did you not see it? Token and Foxina playing their own evil little game. Idiots. How dare you, Glow? I've done this for you. You've done it for me! No, you've done it for your own selfish gain! <clears throat> what wouldn't you do for power, Foxina? You never seem to get it anyway. You always seem to fall short. But who's the most powerful out of you in token? I wonder. What have you done to Pooh, Mrs B? She hasn't done anything to me, Brownie. She just made me realise the truth about life. What are you talking about? The truth about life? This doesn't make any sense, Pooh. You've never been like this before. Well, you wouldn't know anything about that, Brownie. What are you talking about? I'm not claiming I'm an expert on many things, but... I give sound advice when I can, and I don't understand why you're being like this, and I know her! She's just a horrible, horrible bee! How dare you, Brioni? Why do you need to be so nasty? And you accused me of all sorts of things, Mrs. B, that I just don't understand! Neither do I. You've changed Pooh into something that we don't recognise. He realised the truth of life. Mrs. B's Roy, I realised the truth of life. What does that even mean? Gray's Roy, what does that even mean? The truth of life is when you realise things aren't the way you see. I'm making this. No, you go. This is my house. How dare you? This isn't your house. I own this very house. No, you don't. I'm making food for the children. They're my children. Hedge is mine and Hootie is Susie's. Don't you dare do that to me. How dare you? Get out of this house. Don't be so dramatic, Mills. Mummy! What have you done to her? Nothing! She's a piece of evil crap. Are you okay, Mummy? Just hurt myself, hurt my arm. Look what you've done! It's okay, we're here for you. Thank you. 
Thank you to you both. What the hell is going on? Do you want a plaster, mummy? No, I'll be fine. Oh. Look what she's done, boys. Look how horrible she is. I see it, Neil. I see it. Me too. Me too. Goodbye, Mummy. Sophia, are you okay? I'm moving you. I hate Mummy. I hate her. What is that? She's been nasty to me. She, she, she said nasty things. <laughs> Wait outside, Sophia. I'll go and speak to your mum. Speak to her? No. I, I, I just want to grieve. I don't want to be here anymore. <laughs> You, what are you doing here? What is going on? Why is Flora, why is Sophia saying you're being horrible to her? She's a nasty little girl, that's why. Spoilt brat! Flory, she's your child. She's my child, our child. How can you say such a thing? Leave me alone, brother bear. It's got nothing to do with you. It's got everything to do with me. I'm her dad. Right. Let's sit down and have a nice cup of tea and talk about this. No. I do not want to sit down and have a nice cup of tea. Now leave me alone. Foxina, I want to know what you've done to Token and how you can revert it. Neil, I mean it. I'll do no such thing. She's stupid. She's a stupid old rat. I hate her. Well, that may be, be very well, Foxina. But clearly... I don't know. I can't cope with this anymore. You never could, Glow. That's what makes you so weak. And what? Well, you aren't weak? It's funny that, Foxina, you aren't weak. Don't you dare, Neville. I need to work out what I'm going to do next. All this looks like to me is brainwashing. Pooh, you look like you've been brainwashed by Mrs. B. Why? You would know all about that, Brownie, being a fascist. You're right, Pooh. Stop calling Brownie the... You know he's not a fascist. What is that even supposed to mean? <sighs> Brownie is a good example of the... My man. It's used to the look like the fascists. My man, not me. I haven't even done anything. All I have done... Has had an opinion. I've not tried to make out that, you know, I'm something else other than what I am. And I haven't tried to aggressively make people think what I think. That's the difference between me and you, Mrs. B. I am no a radical. We should go, Mrs. B. Get away from these toxic people. You're right, Pooh. Come on, let's go. Goodbye, toxic people. Mama, you okay? I'm fine, darling. I'm fine. Hedge, she isn't your mum. She just isn't. She is. She's the best mum that me and Hootie have got. <laughs> oh, all that 
upset, Pandora. Leave me alone, you evil. Why don't you two go inside? Play. Okay, mommy. And as for you, we need to talk. Talk? Talk? Yes, talk. Why have you taken over our lives? Because I felt like it. You felt like it. Yes, that's what I just said. Now, just get on with it. I'm their mum now, and there's nothing you can do about it. <clears throat> Flory, I want you to tell me what's going on. <coughs> Flory, answer me instantly. I don't understand. Sophia says you're being horrible to her. What is going on? I told you, Brother Bear, it has nothing to do with you. And that's the end of it. The end of it? I don't think it is. It's not the end of it. It's just the beginning. There's a child out there that's incredibly upset about something you've said. Now, what is it? What is going on? Go away, Brother Bear. Go away. Dad? Oh, Sophia, you're still... What is it? Can I live with you, please? What? That is not acceptable. You can't live with your dad. He's terrible. Flurry, what the devil is that all about? You see, Daddy? She's been nasty. I am not. It's called discipline. Or you're going about it the completely wrong way, Flory. That is not discipline. That's just getting angry. <sighs> Please, Daddy, I'll live with you. I don't want to live with her anymore. I can't be doing this. I'm going out for some air. Foxina, what, Glow? What do you want? Change Foxina book, or at least Troy. Please. I don't know how to. I said at least Troy. What is your problem? I've never had anything like the gem before. I don't know how to use it. You used it to make Token into a slave. So you can use it to change her back. Neil. No. Foxina, I'm warning you. Yes? And what are you going to do, Glow? Nothing. That's what I thought. Of course it's your decision. Do it. Or you'll have me and Neville on your back until she's changed back. Well, what do you see? Brownie, it's okay. Why do I miss no? Me and Pooh used to be such good friends. And now because of all the political stuff, we're no! Brownie. It isn't really. It is! I wish I'd never got involved. Oh, you were. And you'll remember it. But this isn't your fault. Mrs. B, by the looks of it, has brainwashed Pooh. And turned turn Pooh against the people he loves. <laughs> yeah, you're right. This is Mrs. B. She's twisted everything. 
She's even claimed I attacked her, which I didn't. I know, Brioni. Calm down. I'm not sure if there's anything we can do to stop this. We should try. We should try and get Pooh away from her. She's toxic. And that's the truth. Hang on, man. I know, Brioni. Mum. We need to do something to get Hedge and Hootie away from males. What can we do? Why have you two given up? We try to fight her. What do you mean you try to fight her? She gave us an ultimatum. One million pounds for the children. What? And you agreed to it? No! We didn't agree to it. We declined and then she got angry. And then... She took over. She hurt your mum. Yes, she hurt me. She scratched me. Oh my God, mum. What's she done? So, we decided to, to see when you returned. But we need to do something to get rid of her. Of course we do. But what are we meant to do? Well, Foxina, have you decided to change token book? That's what I was just asking. Fine. Token, come here. Neil, what are you going to do? I don't know. Change back. Dark! Oh God. See, I don't know. I don't even know how I done it the first time. Oh yeah. I know. Change back. <laughs> Foxina. <laughs> Token! What the? How dare you change me like that with my own gem? Your own gem? What, the gem is yours? Yes! How dare you? Get off of her, you... <laughs> you will pay for this, Foxina. You will pay for this. Why are you doing this, Mills? Why? Because I've always wanted children, that's why. Yeah, but Hedge and Hootie aren't your children. They are. And that's the end of it. Biologically, Hedge is mine. And Hootie is Susie's. So what the heck are you talking about? They're my children. And that's the end of it, Pandora. That's the end of it. What do we do now? We make a plan. Like what? She's clearly delusional and she thinks that they're her children. There is nothing that we can do. Nothing.